Good day, Commander. This briefing will guide you through the main tasks in Orbit Industries. Your tasks will be to extend this station and produce resources. These resources are needed to generate income from contract work, so-called projects. This view shows all projects which are currently available. Completing projects will produce income or unlock new technologies. And some will progress you through the mission. Icons inside the project entry show which kinds of resources are needed to start the project. If a system is missing that produces this resource, it is grayed out. In this case a briefing center needs to be built before the project can be started. The station can be extended at connectors. There are blue and yellow ones that each link specific modules. Select a blue connector since the briefing center can only be built there. This view lets you control which resources are produced. Only fully wired systems produce resources. These will be required by projects or other systems. Systems that are required by the briefing center are already placed and fully wired. Required systems are shown as input in the overview panel of a system chip or the chip itself. The briefing center is fully connected. Projects that depend on it can now be accepted. The project is now ready to be started. Processing a project takes some time. You can see the progress when you select the tabs to filter on the left. More projects will be available from now on. Follow the mission projects to achieve the overall objective. Great success! Commander, a ship on its patrol on the Galgar system borders found a wrecked ship. The model and origin species could not be determined. They have asked us if we could investigate the shipwreck. The rescue team has been dispatched. We expect them to return in a few ticks with results.
Every system that is placed costs upkeep each tick. The amount can be seen on the overview panel of systems or their modules. The global income and expenditure of your station is listed inside the station management interface in the tab finance overview. Commander, the rescue team has returned from shipwreck and the results are available for review in the station management interface. Commander, the rescue team recovered an encrypted data core from the unknown ship. Besides that, there was nothing more that could be rescued. I think we should task our scientists to decrypt the data core as soon as possible. If there are two or more blue connectors on a preview module you can choose between them.
our best data engineers started to decipher the encrypted core. At a first glance, the used encryption does not reflect any known algorithms to us. This might take a while. As your station gets bigger the chance for errors increases as well. They can occur on every module and will have a negative impact on the efficiency of your station. Systems with errors have reduced efficiency. The more severe an error is the worse the efficiency will be. The output of a system is distributed to its connected systems. If a system gets less than the maximum of any input resource, its efficiency is reduced. This will slow down progress of running projects that depend on these systems, while the upkeep costs of the used system stay the same. Good news commander. Our data engineers successfully decipher the recovered data core. Results are ready to review in the station management interface. There is yet another resource that all systems need, which is not distributed through wires, workforce. In this mission you started with some workforce already. This resource is needed to keep the efficiency of other systems at their maximum. So in the end, they will produce faster. Building and connecting workforce systems will increase the maximum workforce that is available on your station. It will slowly increase until it reaches the limit. You can see the available workforce on the left and the required on the right side of the parameter panel. The administration team is eagerly starting to filter and category the vast amount of new data.
The administration team is eagerly starting to filter and category the vast amount of new data. The administration team is eagerly starting to filter and category the vast amount of new data.
Commander, the administration has filtered and categorized the data from the recovered data core. We should see what they found. The chance for errors and their spreading can be reduced by infrastructure modules. These modules affect other modules in a certain range. More detailed information can be found in the station overview inside the station management interface. Data comparison showed that 92% of the contained and readable information was similar to already known knowledge. Within the 8% left that was unknown, star position data extracted from the core showed that the ship was from an unmapped region near the center of the galaxy. Not reachable within the current technical limits and based on its age and engine, the ship could not have traveled the distance by itself. Given the origin of the data, to determine the further procedures with the gain knowledge, a commission of external consultants, experts and decision makers should be formed.